My name is Maya Bloomberg, and I'm a hematology nurse practitioner specializing in bleeding disorders and sickle cell. Birds Disease Day is a crucial moment to raise awareness about conditions that affect only a small percentage of the population, including hemophilia and sickle cell disease. I want the world to know that while these diseases might be rare, the impact on the individual and really the entire family is profound. These disorders bring unique challenges from finding specialized providers to navigating treatment accessibility and affordability to just coping with the emotional toll of a rare diagnosis. These individuals often face misconceptions and lack of awareness, making advocacy and education critical. By joining forces on Rare Disease Day, we not only raise awareness, but we also stand as a community that understands the intricacies of these disorders and get one step closer to an equitable future. Hi, my name is David, and I'm a Polycythemia Vera PV warrior. PV is a rare blood cancer. To me, living with a rare disease is not just a medical journey, it's a testament to resilience and the power of community. Rare Disease Day, for me, is more than just a date on the calendar. It's a beacon of hope and solidarity. It's a day when our voices, which are often lost in the vast sea of mainstream health issues, rise and converge into a powerful chorus. My name is Josh. I'm the co-host of the PNH podcast and the PV podcast, Stories from the Marrow, and I hosted the Let's Talk Mental Health segment on the Bloodstream podcast for the past two years. My disability, I'm not even sure it qualifies as a disability. It's called aphantasia. It's only recently become something that is studied by scientists, and it's an inability to visualize with my brain. Uh, So when I think and when I imagine, I don't see images. That only happens when I'm asleep and I'm dreaming. Rare Disease Day is so important. It's an opportunity for the world to see the diversity of people who are living with various disease states. Hi, my name is Tamara Scriver, and I'm a person affected with PK deficiency. I also work with a nonprofit that supports people with PKD. I am super excited about Rare Disease Day. I think it is a time to celebrate all of the progress that we've made in the rare disease world. And it's a time to take us out of the shadows and put us into the spotlight for all of the um, progress that we've made and to make us mainstream. My name is Nina Maria and I have beta thalassemia major. To me, Rare Disease Day means recognition. It means being seen. It means bringing much needed awareness to the community. My name is Dana and I have polycythemia vera. To me, Rare Disease Day means ownership and personal empowerment over my chronic blood disorder. Rare Disease Day enables myself and others to help educate the broader community so more research can be made to hopefully one day find a cure for polycythemia vera and other blood disorders under the classification of an MPN. My name is Janet, and as the executive director of Chess Foundation, my connection to the community is personal as a mom and sibling with a long family history of severe hemophilia A with complications. To me, Rare Disease Day means taking a moment to honor the sacrifices and challenges our community has faced to celebrate the advancements in care for those with hemophilia A and B, and hopeful for equitable expansion of access, diagnosis, care, and treatment for those with the potential to menstruate and all coagulation disorders. 